Welcome to another unedited video here on Food Review UK. Uh, yeah, so this is my whole video, spoilers. Um, so yeah, there's more than just in the thumbnail, but I thought I'd go through this because we just had a birthday trip. It's my birthday, sort of, it's like my birthday weekend. Um, anyway, so yeah, we thought we'd go on a trip to Milton Keynes and buy some stuff. So there's some of the cooler stuff that we got. Uh, this is Animal biscuits and their banana milk flavor as you can see £1.50 and I'm sure eagle-eyed viewers will recognize the price label there HMV uh, this next one we did actually receive vouchers from treats by Mars or Mar Mars I should say Mars Corporation sorry their their Instagram account is treats by Mars um, so these are new Maltesers ice cream bars from Asda so yeah they sent us a voucher for us to promote them uh, I'm not saying thank you it's cheap advertising for them. Um, so, yeah. But I am great. I'm, I'm great. Am I grateful? They're sort of exploiting me. It's a difficult position with gifted stuff. Gifted. Because, like, like they are exploiting me by not paying me. Because they're getting more value out of it than the £10 voucher that they sent us. So, exploitation. But, yeah, oh, anyway. You're, uh, let, me, let me know. If you're interested about me talking about this subject in another video, and I'll do a video about whether you think it's exploitative or all that stuff. Anyway, right, uh, so <laughs> Finny Tornadoes uh, candy. Uh, these are ice cream flavor. I love the pencils. These are ice cream flavor. They're limited edition. I think I have had them before, actually, and I seem to remember them being really nice, but a little birthday treat. Uh, moving on to, these are Munchies Cookie, uh, cookie Dough Ice Cream. Now, these... The cookie dough ones have been out before. They're claiming that these are new. I think these are just exactly the same and they've been released under a different name. Uh, let me know if you want a review of these. I, I probably would do an un, 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 unedited one. I think I did a review of the previous release. Uh, another couple of products here from HMV. This one. Oh, fingers. Uh, oh, spoilers, price. Yeah, we got absolutely taken to the cleaners for this one, guys. Three ninety nine, but I'm not gonna lie. The thumbnail on this, I've got to review this. The thumbnail on this is gonna be extraordinary. This is sour blueberry flavor. I mean, just that can, that can design is outrageous. And then just some, um, what are these? These were also three ninety nine. Honestly, like, yeah, proper rip off zone in HMV. Um, and this is like birthday cake flavor. I hope I can't actually read Japanese. Um, but hopefully it's birthday cake flavour. Yes, cookie birthday cake flavour. Uh, so I thought it'd be interesting to see what the birthday cake Japanese Oreos are like. If I've had these before, it was years and years ago. I was absolutely delighted to find the Millions Raspberry Body Fuel in Home Bargains. Been looking for this for a decent while. Um, not expecting too much from that, but I think it might be nice. A nice candy raspberry flavour. Now, this is Bang uh, Energy Wild in Watermelon. Uh, I picked this up just because Bang is a really good energy drink. Uh, they're really high in energy, so they do definitely stimulate you. Um, and I, I bought it from Home Bargains because it's like 69p. Normally, you're importing these for two or three pounds ish, maybe more. Uh, this is, I believe, a brand new flavour from Tango. This is Tango Mango. Got this from Asda. Uh, do you know what? It was such a disappointing trip to Asda because they've got stuff like Raspberry Ripple, Milky Bar Buttons. Uh, there's like Aero Melts. There's a Aero Hazelnut. There was like four or five things that we didn't get. It's supposed to be the biggest damn Asda in the UK. And yet they don't have proper stock of things. But yeah. Tango Mango, let me know in the comments, is this, is this completely brand new, or have they had this out in the past? Uh, then a little find in, um, uh, where was it, bloody Yoldy Mr. Sims. These are only like four quid, which for cereal, obviously for, for UK cereal, it's quite expensive. But for import cereal, it's not too bad. I do wonder if it's like probably nearly expired or something. Yeah, used by 4th of March, that would be why. Uh, anyway, yeah, IHOP Blueberry and Syrups Pancake Cereal. Pretty cool. And then last, but by no means least, this is very interesting. Look at this. Got this from Costco. Again, wouldn't normally buy this kind of thing, uh, but this was like a, a birthday treat item. Uh, pistachio squares, um, keto and stuff. No, sorry, kosher. 
rather than keto. Uh, anyway, so I think they're like little, almost like pistachio brittle square things. Uh, right, that's it, guys. Let me know if you want reviews on any of these. I mean, I'm definitely I'm reviewing these on like TikTok or Instagram, whatever, because we were send those and exploited for them. Reviewing that because I love the packaging. Uh, and I'll probably review this as well. But if you want anything else reviewed, let me know. Thanks for watching. That is the whole...